From the bullet punk universe comes a collaboration between Quix and Kid Robot. It's Ukami and Hitsuji, the Death Colorway. This is a Safubi 2-pack released on the Kid Robot website and split between Polyphony and Kid Robot. So there was 100 for each company. So an Asian release and a US release. This one I got off KidRobot.com. Like I said, they only had 100. And I did not have the original colorway of this release that Kid Robot did. So I was happy to check this one out. I thought the styling on it looked really cool comparatively. And here without the plastic, you can see the reflective metal look, which of course matches the whole quick style. And on the back, it has the full story of Okami and Hitsuji. Let's go ahead and crack this one open. Looks like it releases like a traditional box off the top. Oh, that's cool. Blessed are the meek. Very cool. Taking the top off, the bottom of the box has Hitsuji, so Okami, Hitsuji. And there they are inside the packaging. It's got kind of a, an oily feel to it, you could say. And on the bottom of the bottom box piece, there are the two of them. So very good job on the artwork on this one. Taking a look here, I can see they do have little ties that are holding them in place. So I'll loosen those up. They're kind of stuck in there. This one's not. The companion piece. I love this colorway, how it kind of shifts on the body itself. There's the quick stamp on the bottom as well as Kid Robot. Let's see if we can loosen out the big one. Oh, I see. The, the bat is fixed in with the wrap as well. And the other hand. So this will take a second. Finally! Could certainly just be me, but that package was frustrating. There we go. The big general, Ukami, with the bat. And there actually is paint on it, on the arms. As the logo that you would expect. Both sides, same logo. You can still get the, the details of the zipper and the full mold. Yeah, it's a little oily, that's really weird. But you get that nice variation of the color. There's also the printing on the shoes, which you can see there, and on the backs of the shoes, which is also there. And, just like the other one, Quick's logo on the bottom. And of course the helmet has the skull logo as well. It's a beautiful piece. I'm happy to have it. It is so fooby, you can tell. Yeah. I dig it. I think they're an awesome companion set. Let's go ahead and give them both a spin. Thanks for watching. Thank you.